there's animation, there's web design, there's web coding, there's video, there's DVD creating, there's writing, there's printing, canvas, drawing, um, loads and loads of stuff that Adobe offers. I wanted to draw on a computer, I wanted to make animation on a computer. So I sat there with my Vario for like, I don't know, five years, learning it all myself. So what I love about creating on the PC is Adobe software. Adobe software is fun, exciting, has very, very high capabilities of creating media. So I started out using Adobe software when I was about 17, 18, and I started filming skateboarding, man, and putting the clips together using an application called Adobe Premiere. Yep. I loved using Adobe Premiere because it was quite simple. You just cut the clips according to your mouse and it's quite, well, dynamic at the same time as being very effective and easy to use. So this is Premiere and it's a cool production system, man. It's like a really, really good program and there's loads of stuff you can do. I make titles and stuff like that. But this is the program and this is what the program looks like. So I learned effects and how to do time lapses and how to do dissolving characters, layering the same image. So you take three shots of the exact same image but with differences so with the differences one over the other you can then manipulate it with an effect to make it seem like a ghost with transparency for example so over the years it's been like a progression totally with animate and premiere mainly and there's different forms of media on my in my web presence and on my pages so my web presence or my pages started off with my youtube channel and the very first video it started off with was a little short documentary about my skateboarding which is this here slight insight corner skateboarding documentary on me it took me three days and that was filmed and edited by me when I was 17 using a Panasonic 3CCD digital video camera and originally in Premiere they used to send information using a firewire and then you play the tape and copy it into Premiere and that is basically where it all started. It eventualized as me definitely having skills in the media that I'm offering to teach, for you to buy, for you to download for free. And I created the company Ultra Dream Productions about say 10 years ago. But I didn't think I'd make anything of it, but I constantly keep thinking and always thought how I wanted to progress to being professional in all media aspects or all media genres. So one of the genres I've been doing for over 10 years is drawing digitally with Adobe Animate which originally started off as Adobe Flash and you can draw loads of things and I ended up drawing pictures that were artwork like this bird for example 
So we're just going to wait for the bird to load up. And this is something I've drawn in Total Vector artwork. But this then fueled another page, which was my Facebook page, which I have all of my artwork, which I think is decent enough to be, well, shown to the public. And this is what some of it looks like. If we go to my page, which is www.facebook.com ultra gene and then go to all albums and go to vector artwork and this is some of my drawings that I do with just vector which means the exact colorization of just the computer so pulling out rectangles and stuff like that and it eventually ended up being stuff like this here. And this is one of my favorite pieces. It's one of my elves. And then I got to doing other elves, like this elf, for instance. And that's when I started building my Facebook page, wanting to separate genres into different areas of the internet to create a presence. So this is it, loading up, man. This is the application Dreamweaver and as you can see this is another absolute powerhouse of productive system. So Dreamweaver is a WYSIWYG editor with what you can define as a web development project. WYSIWYG means what you see is what you get. That's a professional term for it. But you start off building a HTML document, which is Hypertext markup language, and then make it dynamic in certain ways, either using your knowledge of JavaScript or PHP, or your knowledge of Animate, for example, which is cool, right? So what my web page offers is royalty free items, no copyright issue, you can download stuff for free, you can hopefully buy packages, um, the website has been built from the year 2020, um, I'll be working it every day and have done ever since, I am hoping it becomes a giant portfolio in a crazy way of someone which is me, Benjamin John Pope, developing and allowing for all clients in whatever way they use the website for to enjoy the artwork I create in all genres of media. And that's it man, that's basically all it is. The story will always continue because of it being creative. The story will never end. I'll keep on making new stuff and I'll keep on keeping on. How about that? Peace out.